A local man celebrating 30 years on the job in Napoleon today. John Monk was in attendance and explains why Todd Rothenberger is a much loved local celebrity. Todd Rothenberger has become a staple inside of the Napoleon McDonald's, usually manning the fry station. His career here has managed to outlive pretty much every fellow employee and even managers. Todd's our cheerleader. He's the first one to yell on teamwork, getting everybody riled up and ready to go for a rush. And he's just all around great person. Todd turns 52 this year and usually doesn't work on Fridays, but his bosses called him in to help out during today's lunch rush an excuse to get him in the restaurant to surprise him with a 30th anniversary celebration. Todd is employed through a partnership with Hope Services, who assist about 50 people with varying disabilities to find work in Henry County. They meet new people, they be a tax paying citizen. Anything that you would value from your job, they value also. When Todd went to clock in Friday morning, the franchise owner and his manager told him he didn't actually need to work today, which seemed to disappoint the longtime employee. He just loves the people. No matter where we go, he sees somebody from McDonald's. <laughs> and I'm hoping the people love him. Guess what? Look who's all here for you today. And by the turnout for Todd's surprise party, he sure is loved. Todd received a corporate watch from McDonald's, a crystal french fry display, and an official customized Liberty Center Tigers football jersey. Todd couldn't stop thanking people in attendance and says, his work is the best part of his life. Be happy, have a faith, and a nice day. Thank you. And you like serving people, huh? Uh, yeah. And instead of serving up fries today, Todd was busy serving hugs to everyone he recognized from his 30 years. Then, Todd got right back to work. As long as he can do it physically, he's going to be doing it. Now the only question that Todd was not comfortable with giving a clear answer on was when he plans on retiring. And I think it shows a lot about his character that even though he technically wasn't on the schedule today, he still demanded that he man the fry stand before he had a piece of cake. Reporting from Napoleon, I'm John Monk, WTOL 11.